On today's video, we're going to be focusing on the 2021 box set of the Black Templars. Yes, the release from the Games Workshop on the 2021, the newest army for the soft faction that is going to be the successive chapter of the Imperial Fist. So, let's go ahead and start with the paintings of today. The painting style that we're going to be taking on today's video is going to be the Cenital style. For that, we're going to be starting by first showing up the paints that we're going to be using and their mention above them each one of them where are the locations that we're going to be using each one of these paints remember that always when you start painting you need to plan and start in order an organization way of your paintings and remember on how to use them before you even plan to actually you need to plan it before you actually try to do it because if you don't try to think about it and then you start without thinking about it, then you're gonna be end up in a big mess. So remember, think before doing it. And that is the today's showing up on this video that I always, always was thinking on what should I paint on my Black Templars arms. They will not look like the other ones that I have painted before in a video, but they will be looking more amazing with the Senegal style. And sadly, the older ones, I will not gonna be touching them because that's more work for me and basically my pile of shame is growing each day while we speak like this. Before we even start by painting the miniature, we must first apply the primer. The primers that we're going to be using is going to be black and white. Black on all the miniature and over the top it's going to be for highlighting the areas for with the cenital style that we're going to be applying. It's going to be white or you can use a between a neutral color that is going to be gray as well. If you don't know what cenital style is, basically it resembles to be applying a grading style for example when you start from the darkest to the lightest color and that's the thing that we're gonna be using on our black templars because it will actually help us by just applying an enough amount of black on the miniature and then starting from there to go to the neutral colors that's going to be gray from the gray to the light gray like that remember to use and apply that kind of technique with the cenital style, it's a good way to actually correct and fix many mistakes because you will not be using the base color. Instead, you're going to be using the, uh, the layering color that's going to be the top of the miniature to fix any mistake that you do when you apply by hand the details. So, in here we're going to be seeing that I'm going to be applying the details that's going to be first the shoulder pads as you can see i have made some mistakes on the marks painted over top but i fixed it by just applying the same technique that i mentioned before with the central style that's going to be black gray and light gray if you apply like that the miniature will be looking like you apply it with the airbrush again and without any product at all so it's a more easy way and standard way and fastest let me tell you with central style it will be the fattest way fastest way to finish all your miniatures then you have enough all around the places and everything because in the end when you apply and instead of doing a layer and everything like that that will eat your time it will be like a parade ready and a much better version like a 2.0 version from your side i'm sorry if i get myself in between the camera and the miniature but as i am not using a magnify glass or a lens I'm actually using my eyes that are really precise and to paint every kind of details on the miniatures and I want to be really focused on this side so I'm really sorry again I apologize to get in between the camera.
so here they are my black templar army all finished up five miniatures are going to be primary crusader squad one of them is going to be the sixth one is going to be the primary sword brother the second one it's, uh, what we have it's going to be the primaries initiated those are going to be our main battlefront miniatures uh, infantry squad on the battlefield and second we're gonna be having as well from this primary squad that we have we're gonna be having another kind of miniatures as well that are going to be yes as you can see are going to be the primaries neophytes they're gonna be having the problem is i don't have they don't have in this box the upgrade pack to have them sh with shotgun so i basically couldn't buy them because my third party is the third party store that i wanted to buy the upgrade packs they didn't have it so basically wink wink i couldn't afford it to buy the shotguns frame so sadly i couldn't make a kit bashing and everything and lastly what we have a heavy support walker that is going to be the newest primary is for them to brand not a machine that looks like hell of an amazing with the senator style it looks really amazing every kind of miniature is a plot it has an enough amount of base customization i do not want it to give them too much because i want them to be looking more amazing by the miniature than the base itself so if you guys have enjoyed this video today remember that i am always available and my youtube channel you can leave your comments down below and even in my other third places that i love to enjoy myself to on reddit i have a reddit page now you can go ahead and follow me there watch all my trendings if i have any questions you can ask answer them and everything around that i have my facebook group my instagram you can follow me on instagram as well and remember that i'm always available for you but remember some time zones are not the same as mine so another big thanks to my newest subscribers to the channel i appreciate all your help and back on this channel and i hope that the newest ones that subscribe to this channel as well are very good and patient with time because here having fun is saying goodbye and see you in the next video guys bye